guys welcome back to my channel so this has been a long awaited video that actually one of you guys asked me to do a while back it is the furry friend tag cat edition so this is Ruby and she says hi she's very vocal and she's very cute so let's get on with the video so there's questions and we're gonna answer them now I don't know if she's gonna let me hold her for the whole video she's very vocal but this is a furry friend tag video all right here we go so she'll just be around and then at the end I'll show her again but now I have cat hair all over me but anyway I have the questions and so let's get started and she's actually just sitting by the window looking outside the window is right there so anyway this is kind of a fun video and I'll try to do more videos like this so the first question is, what is your pet's name? Her name is Ruby, and I actually um, got her, I adopted her from a woman about seven years ago, and so she already had her name. The next question is, what kind of pet is it, and what breed? Well, she's a cat. And I do, because she's so vocal, I think that she has a little bit of Siamese in her. Um, but she's very affectionate, and I love her to pieces. The next question is, how long have you had your pet? So I, again, as I said, I've had her for about seven years, possibly even more. And she is my little friend that just keeps me company and how old is your pet I think that she is about 13 years old I'm not exactly sure and I keep on looking down because she is right there what are some quirky things about your pets personality well many people have said she's like a little human not because she's so vocal just because she's so smart she's very vocal and she is very affectionate so maybe that's why I say that what does your relationship with your pet mean to you <clears throat> well it means a lot um, if I didn't have her I would be very lonely and I've grown up with tons of animals in my life when I was younger we used to always have cats and then well when I was a little older we had some dogs I would say that if I did not have her, I don't know what, you know, I would just be, again, lonely. Um, she's really affectionate, and she brightens my day, and it gives me something to think about. It makes me be a little bit more selfless, because I have to take care of her. The next question is, what are some of your favorite pastimes with your pet? I house it, and so... She has become my house-sitting companion, and she loves it, so she rides in the car with me. She stays with me while I'm house-sitting, so she gets to be introduced to other animals, to particularly dogs, and so she's made many friends. And then another pastime would be I love taking her outside. Um, she's an indoor cat. But she loves just sitting in the sun, and she doesn't run away. Um, she is kind of old. Not old, but, I mean, she's not like a kitten that would run away. So she stays close by, and we enjoy being outside together. And the last question is, what are some of your nicknames for your pet? Well, I have tons of nicknames. I call her my baby cat. She's my smush because she just lets me pet her and like smush her face without biting me and snuggle with her. So my love bug, my little princess, so. But mainly my smush is my 
the little nickname for my cat. So anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this furry friend tag and I will show her to you again. Hey, maybe she wants to say goodbye. Say goodbye. Subscribe to our channel. We're gonna go outside now. Hope you guys enjoyed. Mwah. Say goodbye. Yeah, so anyway, again, she's so vocal. Furry friend. <laughs> so thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed meeting Ruby. And I'll just see you in my next video. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.